she's so sweet. No. She, she's got a good personality. <laughs> by the Quilt Craft Sew Mall. I'm Raylene. I'm Beth from Fabric Chicks in Gardnerville, Nevada. And, and Just Notions, and we are in Arizona. So no store, so that's why I didn't say any more specifics. I don't want you coming to my house unless you're gonna do the dishes. Uh, or the bathrooms. Oh yeah, the bathrooms. Yeah, that'd be good. That'd be too. good. That'd yeah, be good. Yeah. We could we could chit chat <laughs> while you're doing the bathrooms. <laughs> but yeah, Beth and I are excited to be back together again since we haven't been since Puyallup. So it's been a couple of months. Um, even though we've both been out doing stuff, we haven't been in the same spot. So no, it's been a, it's been a few weeks. Yeah, and this show's great too because we're right across from each other. So in between busy, we can yeah. talk about all of our plans for the future. And we got lots of them. We've got so many fun things planned. If we ever have 15 minutes to sit down and and, figure and work it, all it out. out and work it out. Mm -hmm. but, but today, just like we always do when we are at a live show on Wednesday, we're going to give you a real quick behind the scenes. A couple of things, though. There are two buildings with vendors at this show. Now, we don't have time, unfortunately, to walk over to the other building and show you them as well because we've got to, you know, finish getting our booths ready right. as well. But if you do not already have your ticket, go to quiltcraftso.com. There is a $2 off. You can pre-purchase your ticket. And you bypass those ticket booths, which are going to be crazy tomorrow, and come right on in. And yeah. with the two dollars they save, they can spend it in our booth. Yes, booths. they can, because we do have booths here. And if you are here and in line at the green building, now that's very important. You need to be in line at the green building by nine forty-five. You might win a share of five hundred dollars cash that's going to be given away every day before opening. But again, you've got to be in line. At the green building. Early. At the but green our building. booths are in the yellow building. Yeah, I just had to the check. Building. Yeah, if you want to find us quick, you just go in the main entrance of the yellow building and you run right into both of us. So we're right there, right inside the door. So you ready to get started? Uh, we're ready. Let's but just, see. I'm just gonna say, hey, Lynn. Yep, we're on the road again. Hi, yep. Debbie. Hi, Sherry and Christy. Um, we've got Sharon. We've got all kinds of people on here. Gretchen, she says she's in yeah. Tempe today, but she'll be here to visit us Yay, tomorrow. Too. Gretchen, can't Ruth, wait to see you. Melissa, Betsy, all kinds of, so many ladies are joining. Good. Uh, good Bonnie good. says, welcome to Phoenix. She'll see us tomorrow. So I do want to remind you because you girls seem to forget this. Yes. So first of all, my name is Beth. Nice to meet you. <laughs> this is Raylene. Nice to meet you. Um, we might throw that in as a pop quiz because apparently we're not that memorable. You don't remember our names. No. You just remember us as the crazy girls. Yeah. But um, <laughs> we do have free gifts for you in our booths. If you but. say the right I, phrase. You gotta say the phrase. And it's, I get wild with you on Wednesday. Now here's the little thing we need to add to this. We love doing this for you guys, but these gifts that we give out are not free. <laughs> it is something that we do because we want to be able to have fun and do this with you. So we have to ask that if you're here with people who don't watch the show, please don't say, tell them, tell them I get wild, tell them I get wild. Because if we run out before we get to the last day, some of our regular viewers may not get them. So what we want you to do is then to say, why did you get that? Say, well, you have to watch on Wednesday and next time you'll get one. That's so nice. Yeah. That's so politically correct. Well, yeah. We're not I mean, hurt anybody's again, feelings with that. We would love to give them to everybody, but neither one of us are independently wealthy. So we can't That's afford true. to do that. How so. much for parking? Oh, um, good I think question. It's $10. We all park outside and then like jump in the back of people's kidnapper vans to get in for free. Yeah, it's $10, $10, $10 a, day. a day, I think. Yeah. 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 So, which is pretty much what it is about everywhere we go anymore. If they charge, it's right. pretty much 10. Right. 
Yeah. Victor, we're going to be interviewing Dusty and Stephanie tomorrow or Friday. I'm not sure which I one. I can tell you. Two in both it. days. We'll, you'll catch them. Barrels is tomorrow. They're first. Okay. So right at, a little after 3 o'clock. Vonda, we're looking forward to seeing you. Yay, Vonda. Susan was, oh, there's getting, lots of them are saying they're going to be here. I know. It's a good thing Ron made us a lot of gifts. Good job, Ron. <laughs> Ron's been busy in his sweatshop. Yeah. Hey, Kathy, all the way from Missouri. All right. Well, as we come down this first aisle, you guys will recognize Rochelle's over here on the right. Hi, Rochelle. Hey, Rochelle. She's getting all set up. And then across from Hello. her, Janet. Happy poor setup. Janet. Poor Janet's over here with her rotator cuff surgery sling thing on her arm. So be sure you show her some love when you come to the show because there's nothing worse than being lame when you're trying to set up a show. True story. <laughs> and as we keep coming down, here's the stamp lady. She's getting all set up and ready to go. They do a great demo, guys. So be sure you come by her booth. Well, and I just want to remind you, if you're not familiar with the shows, there are lots of make and takes. There are yes. also lots of free um, lectures. Free classes. There's four every hour, all day long, and they're free with your admission. Mine, by the way, is at 11 and 1 in classroom 1. Um, it'll be the first time I'm doing my new class. I know a lot of you guys have seen my old class, my lesson traditional, but I now do a class called Notions You Need, but maybe didn't know it. And that's at 11 and 1, and it's a repeat. I'm not doing two different things like I used to. It's the same class. But uh, just like I always do, if you come to my class, you get a free gift for joining. So there's another free Oh, my gift. gosh. For those of you who love the freebies. But the bacon takes are great, guys, because you just pay a little fee, and you can sit right in the vendor's booth and learn something totally cool that you're going to pick up and take with you and move on to the next week. Right. Are right. You guys are doing a make and take here, right? Yes. Yes. Okay. Awesome. So, again, that, this is right. When you come in the main yellow building, if you turn to the left, that's the direction we're heading right now. So that way you'll be able to find them. Oh, oh my gosh, here, let's fun. get up and see it. It's candy. Oh, for Valentine's Day. There you go. So, and gentlemen, super fun. Super fun. So it's always a nominal fee for the make and takes. Quick, just quick to cover projects. Their expenses, to kind of, yeah. Just to cover your, your supplies. Right. So. And then we have my favorite embroidery booth. She always has the most beautiful thing. She's from Washington. So if you guys were, those of you that were in Puala, you probably saw her, saw her up there. So she's one of those we only get to see a couple times Sherry, a year. Sherry says, Raylene, your classes are great. Well, we'll see after this weekend. It's a I'm new so one, sure so she's going to be one. experimenting on you girls. So be nice We're to her. We're going to see what happens. It may be totally different at Sacramento after I try it out this week. Oh, my gosh. Christy Lee is walking on her treadmill while watching us. Oh. Don't don't laugh so hard that you fall off. Okay, yeah, no, Christy? We are responsible for that, Christy. Plus, Beth needs you. Yes. And then we have Block Party over here. We've interviewed them before. They have the beautiful... Uh, printed uh, words and things that you can incorporate in your cool projects. Oh my gosh. Really and uh, Linda McGee, he just texted me. She just landed. So oh. she's going to be here with she, these zippers and purses yes. and all her fun stuff. And we're going to be interviewing her on one of the regular show, or one of the bonus shows. And then another favorite vendor of mine, Lakeside Scissors. They have all kinds of cool gadgets. They're who I send everybody to when they come in my booth and say, do you have this? And I go, no, just go right down the aisle. They'll have it. I know they will. So <laughs> good to see you guys. Thank you. You too. And then Copper Needle is getting here, getting set up. Hi. Getting you want to get here right when everybody is done. So that we we'll see the crowd. You, yeah, you don't Perfect. have to fight for parking because everybody's yes. good. Yeah, it's yep. not yep. just laziness. It's no. a strategy. It's not that you slept in and we're eating chocolate bonbons or no. anything because that's no. what we do. Well, tell our viewers yeah. what you're yeah. going to be selling. What's your main thing Oh my selling? gosh, just ruler templates. So okay. I'll be doing lots of demonstrations awesome. all day, every day. So Sick, there what's you your name? Gina Perks. You girls know her. So if you like yes. rulers, come by. Yeah. We're booth number 131. <laughs> yeah, perfect. And you have a store. You, I she do. has a re retail yeah, store. Yeah, the at. Copper Needle in Payson. Perfect. So yep. it's not too far from here for you. We're our fellow Arizona. Arizona. Yes. Nice yes. destination. Yeah. All you Arizona people, we got to support our fellow Arizona vendors. Yeah. True story. So if you have any money left after you go to my booth, then come over and Then you can her. visit Gina. <laughs> yes. <laughs> And then, of course, a couple of old broads. We've uh, definitely featured the the one broad because she's just one broad now. But uh, so she, so I think you're kind of like up. me. So I am fabric chicks, and I put an S on the end, so it looks like I have friends. Right. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. yes. No, I just tell them the other one retires. Yeah. So. Yeah. 
Yeah, Nothing happened to her. She, she has just beautiful retired. stuff. So you're going to want to make sure that you come see this big, beautiful yes. booth. And hey. we are interviewing you late, uh, later not, in this not week. Not this time. Okay. Not well, this time. Okay, so I am going to. I'm just going to put a little plug in here because I'm doing a, an interview for Quilt Show Reno. So oh, join the yes. Show Reno Facebook page. And I'm going to be interviewing the teachers that are here later this, awesome. this weekend. Because yes. there's quite a few of you. Yes. yes. Okay, so I'll be doing a spot interview. That's your warning right there. That's your warning. Yeah, put your lipstick on now because you never know when I'm going to show up. And then across from her, Amy with Uniquely Crafts. We're going to stop and see Amy tomorrow because, you know, we haven't actually seen her in person for a while. And she has a bunch of new stuff. So I said, well, what better way? Let's right. come by and see. And, I believe and she's going to demo. She yes. is going to be demoing. Yes. For anybody that hasn't seen how great and how fun I don't this know. is. Sometimes she has a make and take, but it doesn't look like she's got a table set up. But um, she, a lot of you already have her diamond art stuff. So look for the new um, samples that she's got out. And then right across from her is where Linda is going to be with geese. So she, her flight kept getting delayed, but we've heard she's here. So she will be ready to go. And we'll, we're going to come and see her too. And her fun zipper stuff and all the other goodies that she has. And then we've got cottage rows, lots of cool patterns. Kits and things that you're gonna want. Poor to Mary Beatty. Mary Beatty. I wish we had a little gnome that could be in your pocket all the time no. and help you out. No. Look at. She says she can't hear or see us, but she can read the comments. Mary, try turning your device off and back, and back on. on. It back might in. help. And then we have Magnific magnificent quilt company. We are actually going to be interviewing them this weekend as well. They are going to be on tomorrow. Actually, we're going to see them and. Purse making supplies. We've featured them before. Everything you would need to make purses, they have it. Yes, all of the fun little um, the handles. Yeah, that you can't the, get the handles they, and the hardware. Hardware. Yeah, all the stuff you can't find. find the findings. Yes. Used to call yes, the findings. The findings. Yeah. Yes. And then sometimes quilt, our word bank, like we lose it. Yes. Quilters rule, who's always here as well, and uh, Patricia is teaching a class as well here. So. They've got some really cool panels. They have a lot of really neat rulers, uh, quilting stencils. Uh, I can't talk. For I know reason. it's kind of well because we've been sweating all day setting up our booth. Nicole, I hope we see you again. Um, because I know you like big booths and you cannot lie. But I have, um, I have a smaller booth this time. Yeah, that's. I have a bigger booth this time. I don't know why, but somehow I got an extra 10 feet. We have we have dropped down now to 40 feet from 50, and that 10 feet makes a big difference. I'm not near as tired. Oh, Sherry, I'm excited. Sherry's already signed up for her classes in Reno. Awesome, Sherry. And Dorothy, I'm glad that you're a chick with me. You're one of my favorite chicks. <laughs> Is she your S? Yes, yes. <laughs> and then, of course, we've got so wonderful dreams and Sunny and Connie over here. They're busy, busy getting set up and already And a big away. booth, three booths. So that's uh, that's bigger than it wrote. So and she has the make and take. She's got more stuff. And there's Sunny hiding behind the table over there. Um, he's the one who actually does all the work. <laughs> Connie's just the pretty face. At least that's what he tells us. Yes. He's, yes. he's the CEO. He carries everything carries out. Carries everything yes. out. Yeah. Yes. And you're doing a make and take? We're doing a, Jane will be here tomorrow yeah. and she'll just be Great. doing make and takes. And we, we have a class one. at noon and how to do some fun stuff with the 10 degree ruler. Awesome. So even so. if you know how to do, cause it's an applique on a tea towel, right? Right. So even if you know how to do it because you've done it before, you've done applique before, they might have tricks and tips yeah. that you haven't, you that haven't you don't learned. Know. Yes. You always learn yes. something, always learn something every in every class. Place. Yes. So if you're looking for towels, we have double ordered and we've got more than we're going to be able to sell. So come down. Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> awesome. All right. We'll see you in a bit. And then, of course, Art Across here is getting set up with the Eclipse Quilter. So if you're looking for a long arm, be sure you come by and see him. And then Desert Stitching, who we missed at Tucson because at the last minute they were not able to attend. So we're so excited that they're here. And uh, she's always got the neatest kits and fabrics, and especially for all this. She's a, again, you guys, she's an Arizona vendor. We have to look out for our Arizona vendors. Got to support Arizona. Nicole, you might be my favorite. She's bringing us more wine. She uh, might purse know. Purse wine? Yes, or, purse wine. Or backpack wine. Yes. There's a difference. Purse wine, I think. <laughs> I'm backpack teasing. wine, though, would be good. <laughs> I'm thinking that'd be yes. like a big old jug. A big old, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Have a good show. So, guys, be sure you stop at Desert Station. Remember, you got to buy twice because if you missed them and they, they missed the show in Tucson, so they need you to buy a little That's extra right. from them here to make up for that. There you go. Oh, gosh. Um. 
Kathy's watching from Everett, Washington. She's the one who attended the show in Puyallup and secretly followed and stalked behind us. Oh, I totally remember yeah. you, girlfriend. I remember. And then just getting set up here on our left is Sharon and Handy Caddy. You guys, if you know Sharon, Sharon's one of our mall vendors. Guys, there are 20 Quilt Craft Soul Mall vendors at this show. This is the, if you're coming out here, you're going to get to see face to face. All those mall vendors that you see on the mall. So, Jerry, anything you exciting you want to tell them since there's nothing here to show them? <laughs> well, I've got some really great lights so that you can sew anywhere. It's portable lights. So, I hope you come back and check that out and be one of the most successful quilters who get their things done because they're organized. That's what the handicap oh, really? is about. Is that what? Being yes, organized. I might be able to finish is. some projects. Yes, exactly. I just enjoy starting them. Finishing <laughs> yes. is like Give work. that to somebody else. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> my people are going to do that, okay? My people. Your people? Okay. Yeah. Well, let's get your people. You, you need to share some, some of those people with the rest of us. <laughs> I need to find them first. <laughs> okay, let's all work yeah. on it together. Right, right. <laughs> Perfect. We'll see you later. Thank you. Okay, and then as we come around the corner, we've got our friends on the right here from TSC Designs. Um, they, they have some really awesome products. And Lots of glitter. And demonstrating and talking to everybody. And, and I think they have a make and take too. Are you guys doing a make and take? Yes, yeah. it says right there. Another great, you guys, there are so many great make and takes at this show. You are going to, if you are coming to the show, try to come all three days. Yeah. If you can, if there is any way that you can, because there is so much to see at this show. Right. Again, there's two buildings. Yes. So. Yes. Um, Lynn, I think you know me too well. It definitely won't help getting organized. Hi, Patty. Patty from Patty Cakes. How are you? Great. I have it on good authority. She was home for a few minutes after road to California. Got her nails done. Jumped in the van and left. What more does a girl need? I, I only nails. know that because I, I go know. to the same girl thanks to her now. And she said, Patty was just here. Oh, <laughs> so you get all the scoop about each other from the nail lady. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> It looks like a four big say, boobs. You got a much bigger yeah. boob. Yeah. Wait, here, I'm going to come here. I'm going to come and get you. Okay. And you're doing a make and take, right. right? Yes, we are. Yeah. So we're doing our, our key fobs key fob. with our designer ribbons. It's Disney. We have sports teams. We have a lot of different things that you can choose. And then, so we've graduated from a double boost to a quadruple boost. So we have four spaces now. Awesome. I know. Well, and, uh, but it makes right. a difference, especially these busier shows where there's so many people. Yes. They can get right. in your booth easier. Yes. And isn't this gorgeous? That's, That's a, a fun one. That's and even, fun. If there's, mm -hmm. even if the booth is kind of crowded, we get through the cash. I mean, you go through the lines. We, we got it kind of dialed in, so yeah. you go through quick. Yeah, right. these shows, okay. you can never get worried about a long line at a cash register because well, we we're have moving two it. Cash, We have two cash yeah, registers, perfect. so we have Good. plenty of You can get everybody going. Time. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Good. And thank you. Besides, welcome. you're here to enjoy the, the day. It's an event. Make it a fun one. Don't get upset if there's somebody in front of you going slow. Life's too short for that. That's right. Take yeah, just, of all the make and takes and right. spend the day. Yes, exactly. yes. Like or said, two or three. You, you got to try to be here more than one day if you can because there's so much to see at the show. So. Absolutely. Thanks, thank Patty. You, and then we got Vicki uh, says she's excited to see us here. Uh, we're excited to see you too. And we've got Gwen from North Dakota. Awesome. All kinds of fun stuff. Mary Vitti, try turning it off and turning it on one more time. Maybe then you'll get sound. So we've got tailor made tables. If you guys want an extension table for your sewing machine, they do all sizes. He makes them and they are really, really well made. Stop by and see Dean, talk to him. Um, again, some of the nicest tables that are out there. And then our two busy bees, our good oh. friends from New Mexico, uh, are here with a great fabric selection. They have lots of notions. They have the 108 inch backs. So you're going to want to make sure you come and see them so in the you. second aisle. And Kathy, I do think Desert Stitches booth is bigger. They kind of wrap around. So they've kind of made use of that corner space. And then we've got pedal stay. So if you're one of those people like me that, you know, if you don't have your pedal on one of these, you're chasing it around the room, stop and see them and they will get you hooked up. And then of course, across from here, this is Sharon. You guys know Sharon from 108 inch quilt backings. We featured her on the show a couple times. She is one of our mall vendors. She's got all coats. Oh my gosh, I didn't even know you were here. Well, that's right, because you were in Tucson. Oh, yeah, you should have seen Tucson. It was I, like, it was so exciting to yeah. see her face to face. Uh, the party can start now, girls. The party can start. <laughs> it's 
Yes, our Betty Adele from Talk Couture. That third one is always a charm, Mary. Third, third time's always a charm. I hear that with husbands too. Still for you. It, she, well, you know, it's setup day. It's That's set kind of what happens on setup day. Come back tomorrow. But when it, we'll but the hot mess turns into a really cool looking booth. She yes. always has the best know. little displays. I want to just pick it up and take it home. <laughs> I don't want to actually do it myself because I won't ever get it done. But remember, she, they're going to be demonstrating. So if you haven't seen it before, this is another booth you want to stop and spend some time. Do you have a make and take this time? Uh, maybe. Maybe. We'll see what we got. Yeah. I don't know if you're aware of this, but on Wednesday's show, we told everybody to tell them they get wild with you. Oh, yeah. well, well, so hopefully you've got a little something for them. Yeah. If not, just give them some advice. They always love advice. <laughs> like, look both ways before you cross the street kind of thing. Yeah. <laughs> and then uh, our sponsor now is up here through the center of the store. This is a show, rather a store. This is Mall Queens. They are our sponsor. We're so happy that they are sponsoring us. So, and they again, go both sides They've of the got aisle. this whole so. middle section. And you know, I know I'm a broken record, but I say it every time we're at a show. Oh my gosh, here she goes again. Go. And I have to say, because <laughs> if I don't know when they'll sleep tonight, that you would not buy a car you didn't test drive. Why would you buy a sewing machine without trying it out? Come out here to the show. They've got every kind under the sun. The people that are out here in the booth, they are professionals. They can help you get in the right machine so you're not like in the yeah. wrong thing. You right. don't want to be in the For wrong sure. machine. For sure. And you want the help. When you have a problem, you want to have somebody you can call. You can't right. just call Walmart and say, hey, right. how do I thread exactly. my machine? And that's why Beth and I always really encourage you to buy from your local distributors because you get service with and after the sale. And you're not going to get that at a chain store. I'm just going to say, I think that Adele might be more popular than us. They're Absolutely. all saying, hi, good to see you. Hi, hi, good to see you. Glad you're better. Hi. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. They kind of, well, you guys got stay tuned because Adele's going to start to, Rotating in and helping us host the show um, so that Beth and I can get a break once in a while. What? Yeah. Don't you like to work 83 hours a day, eight days a week? Well, yeah, I thought I dropped down to seven days. <laughs> and let's see, what else we got going up here? Oh, We've got Cutco here because, you know, the shows have something for everybody. If you're here with friends and they're not really into quilting and sewing, we've Mary got Beattie. Oh, I, no, I said third Mary. time's a charm, right? Especially yeah. with husband. And she says, yeah, the third, it's true. The third one has stayed alive. Oh my gosh, Mary. <laughs> Mary, that's why I love you. You just say it how it is. <laughs> and then as we're coming up the aisle, we've still, uh, this is more of Mall Queen, Mall Queen's big, beautiful booth. Again, they are the show sponsor. So you want to be sure you come by and say hello. I bet you they got all kinds of specials. Are we right? Tons of specials. Show specials. Yes. Oh, almost, they're almost, almost paying you to take it, girls. Almost paying you to take it, y'all. <laughs> but again, they've got the experts out here that can help make sure you get in the right machine for your need. And again, local, buy local, don't buy chain store. Service after the sell. You need the service after the sell. I know, I know. Well, we try to remind them of that, so. She couldn't sleep with herself if she wasn't telling the truth. That's right. <laughs> So again, we're just sitting, this is still their booth all the way down here. So you can't, uh, you can't say you didn't find a machine here. <laughs> and then so ergo, she has those totally Oh, you got something wrong with your arm too. This, this business is not for the week. Oh, oh, bummer. Good job. Thank God we got Dan to help when we need him. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you. And then we're going to have, well, so light, he'll be here in the corner. <laughs> and also Sharon, I think, oh, is selling his One of my stuff. favorite booths. And oh, look at it. They just keep getting bigger just, and bigger. I don't know. Oh, do I don't know either. Because I'm crying in my 50-foot booth. I'm crying. It's so much work. Oh, I know. You're, you're preaching to the choir, sister. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you think I dropped to 40? <laughs> but the Carriage Country Quilts, you guys, again, this is another favorite of everybody. We featured them several times there. Another one of our mall vendors. Remember, there's 20 mall vendors at this show. So now's your chance to see a whole bunch of them all in one spot. And they have all the beautiful wools and she's got... You guys, they, they dye themselves. They hand dye this yes. beautiful wool. Yes. And they're also who I always tell you when you're making your pin cushions, you want pin cushions to be made out of wool. She sells scrap bags of wool that are perfect for those pin cushions you're going to be making. So be sure you come grab some wool scrap bags. It looks beautiful. I know, so it's clean and, and organized. Yeah. And we've got some more machines. They've got the, the Gamel here in Mall Queens. 
And then more machines. We're literally halfway through this building. Oh my gosh. So look at girls, how long it's taking us. And we're not even shopping. We are chit chatting a bit, but not much. Not much. But it's more than a day's adventure. Yes. And then Savvy Quilters, also lots of cool fabrics, kits. Looks like I see charm packs over there and kits and yard cuts. You name it, she's got it. Yeah. <laughs> All kinds of fun stuff. So be sure you check her out when you get here. And then Superior Threads is here. So if you need some thread. It's like a candy store, it's girls. Like a, it's like a thread candy store. And you know, it's like, we love Superior Thread. Yeah. I only carry a couple of thread items, but it's yeah. Superior. So. Well, and what I love about Superior is they're variegated for the long arm. They've got oh, some good yeah. color mixes. Pretty variegated. Yes. Yes, yeah. yes, yes, yes. And you know, they're, um, I sell their invisible thread because unlike a lot of other brands, after time, theirs does not rot and break. And if Snap you like that, old fishing line. Yeah, exactly. Yes. So if you're going to put a lot of work into a quilt, you don't want your thread to break. No. And then we've got 35th Avenue across from them. Another great sewing machine, uh, Arizona company. Remember guys, got to take care of those Arizona companies. Well, I guess in the, the oh, Nevada. The I'm going to say. Too. You should just take care of the West Coast company. Yeah, that'll work. Yeah, that'll yeah. Work. I mean, I would like to include myself in this little um, yeah. promotion here. Why, you're doing. I don't know why I decided to say that all day. Yeah, so, yeah. Forget about the Nevada. Just shop no, Arizona. It was, it was because I didn't want to feel bad to say support me, 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 me. So me, me, me. Include yeah. the other yeah. Arizonas. And, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, and so then, you can <laughs> sleep tonight. You feel better about yourself. I will. And then of course, oh Calico my phone covered. just died. Oh, oh you're gonna have yours. Yes, we've got Calico cover. I'm gonna give Beth my phone because her battery died, and see if we so she can get your comments back. Whoops, if I can remember how to open my phone. So here we have the Calico cupboard. We've interviewed them many times. Thank you. Of course, Suzanne and her grandsons. The brains behind the business here. Yep, lots of panels and go of with it fabrics. The best panels. Yes. She has the best selection yeah. of panels and fun stuff and the books. She has tons of the fabric books that you can make really quickly for gifts for children. Kathleen, we are in Phoenix at the Phoenix Fairgrounds off of 19 and McDowell. Mc, yeah, McDowell. And it the show starts tomorrow, which is Thursday, and it goes through Saturday, 10 to 4. Right, five. 10 to 5. Thursday and Friday, 10 to 4, Saturday. And you can buy tickets online at the Sew Quilt Craft Mall. Quilt Craft so, not the mall. QuiltCraftSew.com. Yeah. Okay. Don't listen to me. I'm just the pretty face. QuiltCraftSew.com. <laughs> you can save $2 and buy your tickets ahead of time so you don't have to wait in line at the ticket booth. And so Susan says she likes 35th in McQueen. I yeah. know. They are all great stores. Sherry wishes she was here. We wish you were here, too. Um, so Lynn Superior is almost at every show we do. And we must not mention it or something. Well, I don't know. Only the bigger ones. Okay. Yeah, the bigger the shows. Ones, yeah. And then this is some more of 35th Avenue's booth here. And uh, actually, because we started in the middle, we'll have to shoot across here. On the other side, on the, on the main aisle, the first aisle, as you come in, if you went to the right, you would run into Teresa from Big Matt. Um, also, Sue Sparklers, where she does all the the crystals and the iron-ons and things. And we've interviewed her, there. too. Both yes. of those we've interviewed. And, of course, Teresa has been very generous more than one time, even when she's not on the show and donated yes. gifts for our door prizes. And speaking of door prizes, because I know we have a lot of new viewers over the last month. When we're at a show, we are not able to do the door prizes. We are just way too busy. But we will be in studio the whole month of February. So on our regular 2 o'clock Pacific on Wednesdays, we will do it like we normally do. But right. it's just too hard when we're at the shows. Right. And okay. just so you know, we do, obviously, it's at a different time today because it's at 3 o'clock. When we're on the road, it's at 3 o'clock, whatever time zone we're in. Because that kind of gives us a time for the show to die down a little bit. So we can leave our booths. Yeah. yeah that's the main thing. we got to be able to to leave the booth with our helpers and, and be able to go out and do stuff. So, right. Yeah. So, and then we've got A&A &A setting up. They have beautiful jewelry, you guys. If you are a jewelryaholic like me, you're going to want to check them out. Oh, Kathy, I didn't know that. Kathy says her husband works for 35th um, Avenue Fixing Machines. Awesome. But she's not going to be able to make the show this time. Oh, no. Next time. Next time. Yes, and there are wearable arts Look at that, Anne, your favorite place, Sue Sparkler, all the glitter and glitz and diamonds. Big and little huge booth. Yes. So, yes, there's definitely wearable stuff here, Anne. 
And then your Osteen, my favorite iron. She's going to be demonstrating her amazing iron all weekend. <laughs> and then we've got... <laughs> Look at her over there putting on her lipstick in the corner. Uh, you know what? I wish I had been so fast. They <laughs> snuck into my booth and just made me leave. So it's all natural. Oh, all Lori. hot and sweaty. and Lori at All About Color. We know her booth is colorful, colorful, colorful. All Cape Bassett. And yes. I have a seminar every day at 1 o'clock. Seminar, seminar each, each day at 1 o'clock. Peace it easy. Use color, print, and value to make your quilt sparkle and sing. That's awesome. kind of our deal. Perfect. And remember, the classes are free, guys. You don't they have to are. sign up, register, anything. You just go over to the Green Building, find the room you're looking for, and sit down in a chair and learn something you'd normally pay quite a bit of money to take classes. Exactly. It's a great opportunity. Perfect. Hope Perfect. to see you there. Yes, right, definitely. Thanks, and hey. I'll do a I'll do a walkthrough on our my Facebook page so you can see and pick all of the how you Rhinestone doing? Chumont. Custom Creations over here with the candy store of color no. over here. She's got the fat, queen, the fat quarter right queen right here. Queen. The fat quarter That's queen. Right. Mm -hmm. Do you yep. have anything you want to tell them? Uh, no, I think just that I'm the queen mom now and she's the queen. Oh. I'm the queen oh. Uh, <laughs> now, I used to see you guys together at a show. I know. It's she's been in been one or the right. other. Yes. Yeah. Yes. yeah. yeah. We were oh, two weekends well, in a row, you've had enough of each other. Oh, yeah. I know how you yes. two work. Yes. So I come on by and yeah. break us up, please. Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. It could get ugly in this. It could, yes. Oh, I my mean, gosh. It's not going to get much uglier than what we look like now. I know. Setup day is always rough. I know. You know, I know. but our people love us just the way we are. Exactly. Mm -hmm. yeah, they know we sweat. Huh? Yeah. It's, it's not we sweat. Mysteries. No big secret. They know mm -hmm. we sweat. Yes. <laughs> Mary Beatty, of course, I have to help in my booth. No, I don't have to help. I have to do my booth. I don't even, I'll be here till 10 o'clock tonight. It's ridiculous. And we have another make and take come right here at Tesla Stamp. They do a really good make and take. So that's another chance for y'all to sit down and learn something new. Kathy, the colors at the Fat Quarter Queen are super delicious. It's like a oh, candy store. It's so fun. It doesn't do it justice on camera. Yes. You're yeah. so much more vibrant in person. And then another one of our favorites and that we featured, and she's a mall vendor, Monica's Quilt and Bead Creations. And so Monica has been around since I was a kid. Like, honestly, I remember you from way, way, way back when, like 30 years ago. Yes. 37 yes. years, March 1st, right. 1985, I opened. Yes. And I will be closing. So yeah. sad. Yay. Yeah. Oh, I know. Oh, so jealous. <laughs> Yes. So come get everything because she's not going to be around again. That's right. And she's look at all this fabric mm -hmm. she brought yeah. to you guys. Mm -hmm. Fabulous. She yes. is loaded yes. up. Yep. Someday I'm going to be like Monica. I'm going to close those doors and I'm going to party all the rest of my life. Right. Yes. <laughs> People ask me, what am I going to do in retirement? I'm going Whatever to Whatever I want, right? But sew so stuff you want, not samples. Exactly. All I do yeah. is samples. Yeah. yeah, you can use the fabric you actually want. Yes. 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 Exactly. At two o'clock in the morning when you can hardly like toothpicks keeping your eyes open because you gotta yeah. get that sample. You gotta done. get it done. I, gotta get to the culture. I know. Uh, I know. We're, we're envious, but we're great. certainly gonna miss yes. you. Well, it's been a great ride. I yeah. love it. Yes. Uh, for sure. So for much. sure. So get out and see her guys. It's your last chance. Okay. Who do we have here? This booth looks familiar, but there's not a sign on it. Oh, I have no idea. Mm. Oh, you know, is it, more, it might be more of Mall Queens. Oh, oh, it, yeah, probably, it yeah. It's probably yeah. the back side of their yeah, booth. Yeah, back side of their booth. Mm -hmm. okay. Oh, my gosh. We are barely even down this aisle. We better start walking fast. Okay. Uh, oh, Bo, Bo Nash has a huge booth. I didn't even know they were going to be here this. Yeah, we're going to oh. interview her again. Oh, my gosh. You guys will love Bo Nash. Cutest little gal ever. And she will, she'll show you all the tips and tricks for all of the fun, um, artsy, glittery. We're gonna, and we're going to come over and she's going to demo for us on Saturday. No, we don't do one Saturday. I mean, on Friday. Oh, my gosh. Even I, I, I know that. I need a nap. <laughs> and then we've got iBead. So she's got a lot Hi. of fun kits and fun stuff to do. And uh, you're going to be demonstrating, right? Or That's doing a make and take. Classes. Yeah, she's yeah. going to teach right here in her booth. So be sure you check her booth out. Oh my gosh, look at how cute he is. Isn't that cute? Yeah, I just want to take him home. 
And then we've got bear paw. You guys have seen bear paw before. They have all the great wood woodland, I guess you would yeah. call it. More manly quilts. Very, yeah. And it's hard to find stuff for guys. Very much so. But they and have wonderful fabric, wonderful patterns. So be sure you check them out. Lots of panels here. And there's small queens again. He's working so hard. He's all over I know. Move. Yeah. And let's see who we got down here. Uh, I'm exhausted just walking. I don't know. How, honestly, I don't know how you could. So I don't know how you could do the whole show at both buildings because we've yeah. only done the first building and we're so far. We're done with the first. Are place. there tickets good for all three days? Yes. Okay, so you only have to purchase one ticket. Go so to the website. Listen to what you get for ten bucks. You're gonna get three days of the show. Uh, well, you're gonna, you're get, gonna get classes. To meet us. What you're gonna get you to want? see us face to face. And if you say I get wild with you on Wednesday, you get a prize from both of us. Oh, but it's different. It's different. Come to my class. Yes. You get another free gift. You can take free classes. You can do make and takes, and they just the make and takes just cost a couple of dollars to cover their supply cost. So there is so much value in that ten dollar ticket. For sure. It's For crazy. sure. I know, Margo, she does not look old enough to be have been in the business for 37 years. But I can tell you, because um, I worked for Eleanor when I was in high school, and we used to sell patterns and fabric and stuff to her way back in the day. So 37 years is a long ride in this well, industry. Know, and we're 39. Oh, my God. You? Did you know that? We're 39 years. You are your mom. You? Well, I've been with her from the beginning. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. But there's there, a vendor who's been But you're definitely not us. that old. No, you're right. I started yeah. when I was two years old. Yes, so yes. I tell my class. You were like in diapers but in your mom's booth. There is a vendor who's been doing it longer than me, and they're the only one I know of now. And that's <laughs> Suzanne from Calico Covered is like 40 Oh, years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense, mm -hmm. yes. Hi there. Yeah, we would love to be yes. introduced to you. Are you the queen? This is my mom. This is oh, you my mom. are the mole queen. The queen of the mole queens. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. So, so what made you decide to open this crazy place? The kids. <laughs> uh, it was my parents, like my mom and dad both kind of started it in 77. Mm -hmm. And right. they just kind of kept on growing. And, and yeah. The, like my and brothers and I, all so three of us were in the business. All three of you. Yeah. So so what made you decide to stay in the industry? Because I have a son and he he would rather go work in a rest home or do anything than that. work at a fabric store. Uh, yeah, we kind of just, I've been doing it. Now, it's just your years. way of life. Yeah. yeah. And then yeah. now my son and my nephew, my older brother's son. And yeah. My niece here. I see my yeah. daughter. Yeah. My daughter's oh my the same gosh. way. She worked with me for a few years. She went on the road with me Maybe for a few years. Maybe we're not as nice. And she went, I need a real job. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We're probably not as nice. <laughs> mm -hmm. we, even, we even have our daughter-in-law. Even. Yeah. Even. Even. The daughter-in-law's <laughs> over here. It's a whole family our business. It sure is. But yeah. guys, you know, I love family businesses like this. Yeah, that may, when I'm going to buy something that most families can't even money. talk to each other oh, no. and you know we talk about this all the time but you know this is an investment a sewing machine is an investment family owned company since 1977 they're not going anywhere right and you know we again we're repeating it again but you're not going to get service if you go buy your machine at Walmart or CVS. Right. Okay? Or even Costco. <laughs> or Costco. You, you think you're getting a good deal you but if you have a problem yes. yeah if you have a problem all you're going to be able to do is take it back if you've got the receipt and the packaging. It's only been 30 right. days. And know, sometimes so. it's something so simple. Like I've had people come and they're like, oh, my machine doesn't work. And I'm like, I'm not a machine person. Don't ask me. Yeah. But their needles put in backwards or something simple. And so you want to have people that you can go to to get help, even for the simplest things. And free classes. And, and free classes. classes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. I mean, they're going to teach you. And yeah. Again, they're going to be there when you need them. Right. Which is why we always encourage you to come to the shows and buy from the sponsors because – First of all, they help us have these shows. We couldn't do these without our sponsors. But again, they're going to be here year and year and year and year and year. After, after, after. after. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Uh, yes, I know. Even well, if you work. Beast working for a living, didn't it? Yeah. And, and plus, you get to decide your own hours, right? It's so, yeah. it's so great working for yourself. That, people tell me that all the time. Oh, you get to set your own schedule. Yeah. Really? Yeah, I get to pick which 17 hours I work in the day. <laughs> That's what I was just going to say. Which hour do we sleep today? <laughs> well, All right, you thank, you. thank you. Thank you. Okay, what do we got here? Lots of panels, tons of panels, and a good price, four ninety-five. Yeah. Yep. Okay. 
Um, Nicole says she's going to be wearing skates to get through the buildings. You'll have to. You'll have to because it's a kind of a walk. But the good thing is that your cars are very close to the building, so yeah. you can purchase and run it out to your car and come back yes, and purchase some more. Yep, yep. And then we've got Sassafras Lane. Look at all these Hi. colorful things they've got. The bags. She's putting all these cute little samples up. And so be sure you stop by and see them. And then we've got cool designs by Lori Smith. She's got all these cool quilts. A lot of wool. So be sure you come and see her. She's busy, busy Lots getting all set up. Applique. Awesome. Lots of new patterns, too. Oh, so you hear that? New patterns, guys. New pattern. And then we've got the, the Quilted Trillium. You guys probably remember them from Pialp. We interviewed them on the show. Yep. So be sure you stop by and see them. Oh my gosh, look at how cute is this. They've got a door to their to their booth and they're closed. Isn't that cute? Um, and What's the store name of the panel booth? I oh, think that, that was Small Queens. Queens. Yeah, it was Small Queens. That was Small Queens. And then Midway Wool, another wool booth. So you'll be sure and stop by and see all their fun, cute stuff they've got. Oh, this is the one from Utah, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think so. Tons of fun. Oh, look at here. Mary Beatty, this one was just for you. It's the luck of the Irish, because we know you're Irish. And look at your fourth husband, fifth husband right here. You don't have to worry. They don't say much. They don't even have mouths. Oh, evil. What? Oh, that's cool. Yeah, show that one. Look at this really cool one in the corner. Look at the the, the quilting. Yeah. The quilting alone in the that sand. Is really that neat. is absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. Hey, Anna, how are you? I hope you're staying safe. I think you're in New Mexico already. She's traveling across the oh, wow. states. I know. You girls are crazy. And then we've got Easy Piecing, again, another mall vendor, and they do demonstrations. And we're going to actually come spend a little bit of time with them on Friday it's been a while and we've got a lot of new viewers and we want to make sure everybody sees her cool technique for doing all these beautiful intricate Peace. quilts yeah they scare me the way she does it is so easy. easy i actually have one of her patterns at home i've gotten it out like 12 times and go why didn't i buy it with the fabric so i was going to bring it and exchange it but i forgot it so i'll have to call you because i'm like when am i going to have time to, to pick, pick fabric. fabric out of your stash? I, I don't know. Really that seems really overwhelming. Well, I sold most of the okay. stash. Okay. I'll give you so. that. I'll give you that. <laughs> and then uh, Sweet Peas Designs. She's got a lot of fabric. They've got a lot of cute patterns, little gadgets and goodies and fun stuff. So be sure you stop and see them. Lots of kits and pre-cuts. Beautiful big booth. And then I bet this looks like Julie's over here. Julie's Sewing Center. Look, I'm all busy acting like he doesn't hear us talking to him here. Uh -huh. <laughs> He's busy. He's got to stay focused. Yep. Again, Julie, she has a ton of the 108-inch backs. You know, between the two or three people that are here with the backs, guys, there's no way you're not going to find the color you need between right. these three vendors. And I'm just going to give you a little tip because a lot of people don't know this. Wide backs are a great investment. Yes. You actually get two and a half yards worth of regular 44-inch wide yep. fabric for the price of one yard of wide back. So I rarely buy just, if I need like blends, yeah. I buy the wide back because right. you get so much more fabric for your money. Yes. And it's, fat, yes. it's still good quality, cool fabric. It's right. just, it's bigger. And it's really great it, to use as um, Lynn has told me every time I mention this, <laughs> it's it's good for your bindings because you don't have to piece your bindings. Yes, absolutely. So, so there's lots of perks to the wide back. Sometimes it's a little bit harder to manipulate in the beginning because it's such a big piece but it's definitely worth it yes and then we're so excited because you guys have seen ferals on whoop, the show whoop. so oh, many times somebody said to tell you guys hi but i forget who it was it we was have beginning. not seen them in person for a long time it has been so a long time we're so excited they're here and we're going to come and spend some time with them on the show tomorrow so that they can show you some oh more gnomes no, Mary no. Hey, Mary, do you need me to pick up? Look at, it could be your fourth husband. He's really quiet, doesn't say much. He might be a little hairy, though. Yeah, doesn't eat much. Yeah. yeah, yeah. No, Mary, don't let them abuse you like this. Mary, we love Hi. you. So here's Stephanie over in the corner, but they've also brought all their cool new metalwork stuff. You guys saw they she showed, introduced some of that on the show a while back. 
So they've got tons of it with them. Look at this beautiful stuff. I just love the flags. The flags are just so amazing. And she's got feather weights for sale. Wait, I'm coming to talk to you. And then we have, wait, somebody. Um, Suzanne says hello, Stephanie and Dusty. Hi, Suzanne. I love you. Kathy says hello. Hello, Kathy. Ooh, I'm sure it was Kathy. Yeah, Powell, that's right? your groupies. It is. It is. I know my girl. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I know my lady. Uh, Victor says, Dusty, quiet, LOL. Yeah. That's he, a first. That's right. Yes. <laughs> it's been a long trip, Victor. Yeah. They, yeah. So they come all the way from the East Coast. So that is a long drive for this show. It so is. take yeah. advantage, guys. The, you know, like I said, they've been on the show several times, and you guys are always so thrilled to have them. And we're all thrilled when, because yeah. their techniques and their templates and their little foot is so cool. It's like it, I, I actually could quilt. I bought it. I haven't used it yet because uh, I, I can do it when nobody else, you know, I can't do anything guys. I can barely thread a needle, but I yeah. can do this. You so we're going to come and see it. it. But you think. I know. I <laughs> if you come down, you can have a personal lesson well, in the morning. See, that's what I need to do. I need a refresher and we're going to come tomorrow. And I'll have show. my featherweight already. You could say, yeah. oh Jean my gosh, says she has That'd some of your fine. templates. I'm, it's it's a fun it's a fun group it's, it's a fun, fun you guys are gonna learn something well, that's my every dream. day now that we have you know sold that one part yeah, of the business you're partially retired I am just salivating to quilt or to just actually to do sew something creative something. I know I've got I've people been buying think, this stuff from everybody think all we do all day is it's sew so and have a good time oh. I I remember when people used to tell my mom when she had a store it must be nice to have a quilt shop and just sit and sew all the time yeah, I like, yeah. yeah. when do you I sew? know I, I, always, I always say the only time yeah. I ever get to sew is if I need to fix a sleeve on a quilt for the booth or right. a tablecloth right yeah yeah well, you know, we have come to the end of this row, but I think we need to walk it back where we are because we missed um, Workman Farms and we missed Sherman. Uh, Lynn, if you want me to pick you up any of those flags, let me know. So gorgeous. Look, at, we need to show them this quilting close-up, though. So Dusty is really known for his long-arm quilting yes. skills. Is that the one you've been doing on Facebook? Okay, we're going back over there to see yeah. it then. That's the that one that has I've been, been doing. phenomenal. Okay. Just seeing the little pieces at a time. I'm still counting at 30 pre wax. Oh wow. my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so this is so and, and when he it's says 30 pre rounds, he's talking 30 bobbins to quilt this. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So right now, this is over 6,000 yards of thread in, and it's not even finished. It's oh. just absolutely gorgeous. The and detail geez. is amazing. It's ridiculous, girls. It's it like takes micro quilting to a whole different level. And if, if you're not following them on the on Farrell's Country Stitch and Facebook page, be sure you do because he's always posting. I, we've been watching this quilt be done over the last uh, few weeks. So you do. I'm sure they're she does. Just there. where they are is the question. We do. No, they're over there, right there. Okay. All right. See you guys. We'll see soon. you tomorrow. See you soon. Tomorrow. Okay. So we're just going to kind of quickly walk back up to the front because we, the way we turned, we missed a couple of our favorite vendors. So we want to be sure. Oh, you guys we did. Know we missed Workman, Workman and, and Cheryl. Copper Mountain yeah. And, yeah. and of course our booths. And they look so really nicely put together because we're almost ready to go because I hear it's five o'clock somewhere. Yeah. Although it might not be five o'clock somewhere for us until 10 o'clock tonight. That's when I think we're going to get our booth done is 10 o'clock tonight. So we're just doing one of those. We're walking. Hey, Adele. We're walking. We're so if you guys hey, see Adele, Adele do you know what you're supposed to tell her? What are you supposed to tell Adele when you see her tomorrow? Somebody type it in. Let's see if you're paying attention. Uh, Anna, you're ridiculous. Uh, yeah, you would use a bazillion. Okay, let's see. Anybody? Bueller? Bueller? <laughs> uh, oh, Nicole. You know Nicole is the one who got it. Of course, I get wild with Adele on Wednesdays. Hello, on Wednesdays. Okay, we're almost where we were headed. She, she only gets wild with Adele. Oh, well, that's okay. That's okay. As long as you bring us the wine, we'll cut you some slack. Our feelings are hurt, but we'll get over it. <laughs> one more. One, one more. more. Oh, one more I was second. getting ready to turn. I'm like, why aren't no, you turning? Not quite there yet. Oh. So, oh. girl, I'm just gonna tell you. When I set up a booth, I typically um, get about 20 
to 23,000 steps in, just walking back and forth in my boo. How impressive. I know, isn't that crazy? It's crazy. Like who needs to go to the gym? Who needs a treadmill? Just work for fabric chicks. Okay, well let's scroll up. So here's Raylene's booth. Here's my, my so, booth, which is gonna look a little different to some people because we don't have any circle quilts anymore. Yes. So the, the, the merchandise is the same. It's just the, the display is much different um, since we did sell that part of the business. But I am gonna be, uh, I'm gonna try to do a little demoing in the booth. I will see how it goes. Um, yeah. Annie, I think, is going to help me demo a little bit. Annie and uh, Robin will be here helping us all weekend. And, of course, there are regular Arizona helpers. Oh, perfect. It's here. always good when you've got helpers that yes. you've had before that kind of know the drill. Annie's family. She's yeah. been with us for 20 years or more, but she's family. And then, of course, Mary, who has all those beautiful baskets. Devin, are you working? Look at Devin. Can He's we, supposed to be finishing the boot. Devin, are you working, sweetie? Yeah. Watch her work. I think every so what day. what do you do if she's out of the booth? Uh, watch the booth. <laughs> OMG. We're never going to get done tonight. I'm going to cry. Um, can you find some more banners and hang them or something? Oh, you just got to unload the bins. It's a mess. So when you do back-to-back -back shows, it really is a lot harder Very because difficult. nothing is packed, organized. Well, you know I'm not that organized to begin with. But, but it's really kind of a shit show trying to unpack. So this is why we came back up and around here is because we didn't want to miss. We didn't want to miss, you guys. Here, let's go here first. So we've got Cheryl Copper from Mountain. Copper Mountain. She's from Salmon, Idaho. So if you're ever going through Salmon, stop by. Great. Call her first. So she'll, if, if she's not open, she will open, I'm sure, because we all do. We all do. My cell phone is on the door, so you could even give me a call when you get there. And I'll awesome. Be there. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So Lots of fun, fun things. What's the, what was the most popular last week at on, in Ontario or California? This quilt right here. I it's believe it. Absolutely gorgeous. I believe it's so yes. vibrant. It's yes. so pretty. We sold a ton of them. Like, and you have the shop. kit, I'll bet. We and have she does. Kit. And it's it set really well. It's a good setting. Yeah, I love yeah. that. Yep. Thank you. Yep. I might have to get that one. I know. It's a fun one. And, and add it to my one day. I'm going to do this. Yeah. Part. Yeah. One day. Five, yeah, when you're 95, can't month. see. <laughs> can't thread the needle. Yeah, we What's all have. from now? <laughs> yeah, we all have those dreams, those aspirations. So be sure you check out. She has so many fun things, purses and aprons and kits and fabric and patterns and a lot of fun, fun stuff and unique stuff. Because, you know, you guys have noticed I've been walk as we've been walking through, a lot of vendors have fabric, but what's really cool is everybody's different. Yes, for sure. They're for all, sure. They all specialize in different things, yes. so all their things are unique. And then we've got, of course, Vicki from Workman Farms right in front I know. of her. And, uh, and her daughter's right behind her, Liza. Of course, you know, the kids will all tell you that they're the ones that do all the work while we just go out and chit-chat and have a good time. I see. I went and got a coffee. Yeah, yeah you know, and she's and still working. Sudden, I really need some coffee. So that's what's wrong. With uh, I haven't had enough coffee. I, that's true. Well, you know, we had to that's get up true. at 4 o'clock this morning because we drove in today. Um, we okay. left the house at 5.15. That party I party. Oh, that's her party. I know. I'm not giving her any credit because she got drunk last I night. <laughs> I think she left the lights on for me. I did. I was worried about her. I was like a mom. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. No, I'm, try, I'm trying to sneak in and sneak into bed. And all of a sudden, she puts on her flashlight on her phone. She's like, welcome yeah, home. lady, where have you been? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, you don't get credit for staying out too late. Like, oh. I get credit for getting up early to get here. Okay, but I did have a fabulous dinner with one of my yes, my favorite customers. So, yeah, I'm I excited, know. too, because we're going to be meeting um, some friends on Friday night yes. for dinner. That's, you know, we're, I've got a really fun group of people that... We have a uh, kind of a private Facebook group, but we all used to work with each other many, many years ago at Universal Studios. Mm -hmm. And it's fun because I always post where the shows are going to be. And I have those Facebook friends that I only know on Facebook, a lot right. of them, because they are friends of the friends I knew. Yes. And yes. so it's been really fun. So when we're ever at a show, we let them know we're going to be there. And then when we can, we hook up and have right. some have some dinner and get to spend some time with people that I'm usually just typing. Typing, so yeah. It's and really it's fun. it's a whole it's different so experience. Yeah. I mean, like Connie, we've known each other for two years since COVID yeah. started. Every Sunday she joins our Zoom. She's on every time we go live. Love her. But it was so much fun to be to yeah, see her in person. Yes. Really yes. Yeah. Yeah. That, it was so much fun. 
Well, I think we finally hit every booth in this building. Okay, so we want you to write this down because I know you girls will not remember it because I experience it every show. You get into my booth and you say, oh, I watch you every Wednesday. No, nope, that's not it. That's not going to get you the secret it's gift. It's not that hard. Just write it down, put it in your phone, write it on your yes. hand. Something. It's not that hard. Yes. I get wild with you on Wednesday. How many words is that? I get wild with you on Wednesday. It's only seven, seven words. words. Seven <laughs> words. Okay. And I, so I learned this also because somebody, somebody said she watches us, but she didn't, I, obviously she didn't because she didn't even know our names. Yeah. It's a pretty good bet that anybody that really watches knows our name. So that's going to be our test. If you don't act like you really know and we don't recognize you, we say, what's your name? We don't recognize you. We yes. say, what's my name? Yes. Of course, mine's on my shirt. That's off the go. Oh, my that's not because they all, they pretty much knew your name. They just didn't know my name. You sure? Yes. Okay. Yes. So I'm more popular? Yes, definitely. That's kind of odd. They love you the most. Oh, I don't think you so. Oh, the freebies. <laughs> oh, the freebies. Yeah. yeah. And I'm I a bought, stickler. I bought their love. Yes. Yes. <laughs> All right. So, okay. Reminder, so where are we? We are at the fairgrounds in Phoenix at 19th and, Mc, 19th and McDowell. Two buildings full of vendors. Uh, the green building is half vendors, half classes. Um, there's all kinds of food vendors out here. One of the things I look forward to every year, there's a vendor out there that has the best, best fried pickle spears in the world. Oh. We buy them every day. After my second class, yeah. I stop and get them and bring a salon and I can have a snack. They are so good. And they know oh. me. I mean, it's the same people. Yeah. They go, oh, yeah. I'm here for your pickles. Because I love these yeah. pickles. Oh. But there's lots of food vendors. I know. My of tables always so busy. Stuff. I never get out to eat. Well, I do it on the way back from class. Oh, That's the only okay. Way. And yeah. Ron's here. And he's actually working. I'm well, like, Devin. Ron, yeah, we got Ron and Robin yeah. and Andy yeah. in the booth. Yeah. But again, if you go on to quiltcraftso.com, quiltcraftso.com, you can go ahead and buy your tickets online, then you just show up on your phone, but you're also going to save $2 by doing that, and you're going to save time at the ticket booth, because it does get kind of crazy here, because it is such a large show, but again, the, you know, if anybody's concerned about the crowds, um, the promoters wanted us to remind you, if you come after lunchtime, it does pan out, Yes. but they have really, the reason you see some of these booths are so huge here is that they've really spaced out the booths. The aisles are bigger than normal. Right. Um, so they really have taken that into consideration. And if you want to wear a mask, you're welcome to do that. It is not required. Right. Just so you know, right. you don't have to feel like you, unless you want to. Um, mm -hmm. But uh, let's see, anything else? For sure. Remember, Always do what four, you're comfortable with. Yes. And four vendors, Beth, Raylene, uh, Adele and Linda McGee. All four of those booths are going to give you something if you say. Linda is too. Yeah, she told us on the show. Oh. On the show oh. Wednesday, she said if you tell her, she's got something for you. Okay. Her. Okay. So that's Super exciting. People. All right. So we'll yeah. see you tomorrow. And at I do ask you too. You know, I on Facebook I put the list of mall vendors that are here. Maybe take a picture of that or something with your phone and please show them some love. Let them know that you've seen them. Let them know yeah. you appreciate it because it does take a lot of time for An them to effort. come on the show. Yes. Yes. And, you know, they're all so crazy busy because we know how it is. So please make sure you just mention that you saw them on the show. If you did, tell them thank you. It really does make them feel good. We, they come yes. up to us afterwards and say, someone came and said they saw me. And it makes them feel good. It makes them feel like it makes them kind doing. of feel like they're movie stars. Yeah, it makes them feel like that they're not wasting their time. For you know? sure. I mean, For it, sure. It, it, we all need yeah. a little love once in a while. Right. Okay, so that's right. it. Join us tomorrow and Friday at two three, three, three o'clock Arizona. Arizona time. Three o'clock Arizona okay. time. All right, guys. See ya. Bye-bye. Bye. I don't know what I did to your phone. <laughs>